Hey and what's up? Today I'm here at. Uh, hey and what's up? Today I'm at Sondre Avian's workshop uh, in Ål, close to Gol. We are actually going to drive a full crest this week, and I'm going to drive this old Beatles engine in the rear. <laughs> With the engine in the rear, <laughs> it's going to be painted in RX Cartel colors. It's a car from probably 1970, Beetle with uh, uh, the engine in the back, which is very, very good for a start. Very well driven, probably has around 170, 180 horsepower. Drives like a beast, it's so much fun to drive. Handbrake, gear stick, a uh, loose steering wheel, <laughs> uh, just some switches. The craziest thing with these cars is that the, the engine is air cooled, so they have some issues driving many races in a row, or if some Volvo 240 or something crash into the back of it. Uh, uh, it easily stopped. So, uh, but yeah, I'm gonna put some paint on it. I bought black, blue, and white, and we're gonna try to <laughs> to make it look like a RX Cattell bubble beetle. RX Cattell beetle. So the first layer's on. We're going blue here. So you wanna be a player? But your wheels ain't fly. You gotta hit us up to get a pimped out ride. I think it turned out pretty cool. This is a fun little project. It's time for me to hit the bed. We got a part we needed. Let's check out some beetles. Fifth. Is this what you call a beetle paradise? And what chassis is the best to drive? That one. 1302. And how can you see it's a 1302 instead of 1303? The O2 has a straight window, flat window, and this one have a curved one. It looks like uh, the car is gonna have some, I would say, decent amount of horsepower. It should be a top car, but at the end of the day, there is 290 drivers. I'm not kidding, 200. And 90 drivers that's insane amount of drivers some guys have spent like six seven thousand euros other have been spending two to five I think my car is around three thousand euros probably gonna be 30 drivers that gets through to a final so practice is up next and we're ready to go Since there's 300 cars, there's a lot of waiting here in uh, Ghoul. We have been sleeping here tonight. I made breakfast. What was the breakfast on there? <laughs> it was good. I must say it's super fun to be uh, driving a beat like so much fun sliding around we felt that the gear ratio wasn't 100% correct so we're gonna change the gear ratio or we're gonna change the gearbox and we've got a, a famous uh, visitor visitor <laughs> visitor <laughs> Oh, look at that. Now we're doing a guess who Suniva is now. Today is a good day, because today is a race day. We're good on time? We're good on time. Yeah, team boss is ready. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Every time we go to the start grid, we are actually pushing the car all the way to the grid. And we just started like 20 seconds before the light turns green. The reason for that is that our engines are air cooled and we don't want to create any heat before we have to. No. No. Are you ready? Yes. Feeling good today?
just did Q2, I finished second. It was pretty decent, we managed to get the car ready just before uh, the start and uh, the only thing I struggled with was third gear, I couldn't keep it in gear. But, my mate Sandra over here, he completely destroyed his engine. So we are back in his workshop. <laughs> it's the way it is. It's the way it is. We need to find a new engine for you. So how many hours do you reckon? Two hours maybe. Two hours, yeah. Yes. It's called Folk Race. Yes. <laughs> Yes. And we have uh, got a new engine. <laughs> this is Bill Kozadzi's best. Folk Grace, you rock. <laughs> det är lätt nu, kan du? Ja. <laughs> Grattis. <laughs> championne, championne, ole, ole. We're done with price giving and right now we're sitting here with all the guys bidding on cars. So we hope to keep some of our cars uh, so we can race them in the future. Uh, this guy probably have uh, 3000 bids in it. <laughs> All right, so done with the event, and uh, unfortunately, I lost my uh, my beetle. That's uh, that's folk race, and I I've actually on all the beetle course races I've done, or all the folk race races I've done, I've always lost my car. So uh, this is just one in the line. <laughs> so when you lose your car, you have to take out your seat and all the personal equipment, such as steering wheel, wheels, and so on, like belts and safety net. Yeah, that's it. After a long day at the track. We're back in the, the bus and we are playing the idiot. How's it going, Sondre? No, Not today? Uh, <laughs> Not today. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love winning, like, I haven't won in a long time. It doesn't matter if it's in cards <laughs> or in cars. Winning is winning. <laughs> 